Hello everyone and welcome to Jumper Man Tech where we specialize in HVAC, we do everything DIY and we are back at this nightmare unit and it is once again leaking. Oh my lord, is it bad. That is all water pouring through there. Oh my, oh my. Thank you to everyone tuning in to Jumper Man Tech. We are back at this nightmare and we are going to attempt to repair this. Last time we were here, the whole day, we shut off all the hot water valves coming off of the absorption chiller and we could not get this water to stop to make a repair. This water is super hot and it's super dirty. Oh man, it's even leaking here now too. Oh man, I hope there's not other leaks here but let's see what we can do i cut this hole last time to see if we can get any sort of access because we can't walk in here so this is the access that we're dealing with tiny little crawl spaces this is the size of my hand this space so you can't actually get through there it's too tight you can barely go through here look at my oh my lord look at my body i'm just to squeeze through here okay unit we're gonna have to climb up on this and climb into here squeeze through here and make it to the back corner it's an absolute nightmare funny enough of all things this unit is working and it's heating <laughs> oh man I'm waiting for the engineer to come by he's about 20 minutes away so we're just gonna set up our tools and Hopefully get this water to stop. All right guys, we got two absorption chillers. And the engineer came and we shut it off. We got two chillers here. One, two. So, oh man, what's going on here? This burner. Anyways, we shut it down. Heating water supply valve, this is closed. A bunch of other things are closed. Turned off the pumps. Of course the chiller is off. This is the heating side. Got this valve closed. That's closed. This is closed. These are the pumps. That's the pump starters. They're all off. This uh, valve was closed and this is open to drain Looks like it stopped here. Let's go over to the unit and see what's going on Got a hose connected here and we're draining the unit from here as well the System is currently off All right, it's going directly into this drain All right, Let me get through Still leaking. It's totally a different pattern right now. Let's hope this stops. Let's go to lunch and pray for the best. All right, guys, it's been a few hours, about two hours, and it's still going. It definitely slowed down, but it's bad. I got the system draining right now. Look at that pressure. This ain't gonna work and this room is just insane. This thing was overflowing. I think for now, the best thing is to do something again. It's temporary, man, because look at the bacteria that's growing here. It's just ridiculous. At least let it go into the floor drain. I came up with an idea. Picked up this drain pan, hooked up a PVC connector here with a gasket. I got some fittings, primer, and glue with some pipe. And I'm thinking right now to set up that pan underneath and just set up that PVC pipe to at least drain to the floor until they can figure out what's going on with this water because the heat has been off for a few hours now and there's 16 floors that don't have heat right now. People are going to start complaining this is another hotel. So what we're going to do is we're going to bust the rest of this wall down get some sort of access in there bust that through 
wet vac the floors got the wet vac back there get all this stuff off the floor get all this stuff off the unit and let this thing drain into a pan and then into the floor drain but this water is not stopping looks like we're gonna have to do this temporary repair man this is incredible this is the second time by the way more progress this time but yep still a nightmare some space man <laughs> karate chop this thing <laughs> got the sawzall all right multi-tilver like i can't wait for this <laughs> trying to go home man <laughs> that's it who needs this wall let's get this started my show was waiting for me my girl is waiting for me let's get out of here <laughs> Christian gets that going. I'm gonna set up the primer and PVC for our piping. So when it comes to PVC, you're gonna wanna apply primer first and then the glue. So you're gonna put the primer on the inside of the fittings and the outside of the pipe. This is a bushing. So I'll put it on the inside of this fitting and the outside of this one where they meet. Put the primer, then the glue hold it and sometimes people even do like a quick little turn hold it for a few seconds and you're pretty much ready to go so we're gonna follow that process along the pipe and i have a special pvc cutter over there let's get this situated but this wall is getting taken down so we got access all right we're open really get in there and look this is gonna work perfectly all right and we're gonna come out somehow make our way through there maybe i can go through this back wall we'll see but we gotta get we got something in temporarily this is madness let's clean up a little bit PVC pipe and it's starting to drain. Got at an angle, put some supports, and of course, once again, the water has not stopped. There's still some pressure, it is not leaking. This pan is full, but honestly, this is gonna do. For now, this is gonna do. All right, guys, this is as best we're gonna get it right now. This is with the valves and pretty much everything closed. Honestly, this is not good enough. He's gonna have to turn the unit back on, get the heat back on so these people can actually get heat. What a mess. We're gonna have to come back and return. When he opens up the water, this is definitely gonna get crazier. But we're gonna have to wrap this one up from here. This is as best as we're gonna get it for now. If anyone found this video interesting or helpful, Please drop a like, comment, and subscribe as I come out with new videos every week. <laughs> and I'll catch you all next time.